Well, as you can see, it's snowing and uh, it's wet, but it's the first snow we've had this year. Okay, I'm off to the studio. All right, uh, if you liked the video, please subscribe and uh, give me a thumbs up. I appreciate it. Thanks. It's time to start working on these two. I'm going to change head positions a little bit on him, I think. Well, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to change her eye position because she's sort of dreamy like. But I'm going to turn his eyes towards her, I think. I don't know. We'll figure it out. All right, I had a friend drop in, like I said, and uh, it's Julie Burt. She's uh, helped me in the past with a lot of some of the monumental clays that I've worked on. She just came in uh, on her way to the dump to see what I was doing, and we visited for a while. Uh, first things first, I what I did was I started working on the eyes. I first changed his head position. You can see the big crack in his neck. That's because I turned his head t more towards... Uh, worth many horses uh, because I wanted him to look more at her and uh, so I'm now refixing that neck I just felt that uh, at this point uh, the piece needed to be brought in together with the other piece and uh, it had to tell the story but it also had to be able to stand by itself if uh, somebody purchases just him and not her Now I'm uh, using a Brillo with uh, lighter fluid on it to smooth out the uh, neck and uh, bring it back to what it was before. I'm removing the feathers because I have to be able to work on uh, that part of the neck without damaging the feathers, so I'm going to set those aside. Now I'm just cleaning up the area of the head where those feathers were so that uh, as long as I got them off, might as well uh, clean it up a little bit. Julie uh, had set the uh, camera, so that's why why I've got a lot of space above the heads, but uh, I'm not complaining. It was nice to have some company in the studio for a little bit. I'm wearing the rubber glove because uh, that lighter fluid gets on your skin. It'll sting it a little bit, so I, I wear rubber gloves just to protect my hand. Because uh, I changed the direction of his look from one side to the other, I have to change also the uh, shape of the upper eyelids and the lower eyelids because the pupil of the eye has shape to it. And when it changes the direction, you know, the uh, eyelids uh, change shape. So you always kind of concentrate on that. Now I'm just adding an extra wrinkle in the back uh, because I didn't have one. And I just figured the leather would wrinkle right there where the robe uh, wraps underneath his arm. <coughs> I finished that uh, quill work band on his arm. Now this is the uh, clay itself. 
finished. It'll be finished tomorrow, actually. It's cold, and I mean really cold. I came out and opened my van door, and I had to pull on because it was frozen shut. So, must be down in the 20s right now. Really cold. So that'll be it for today. I've got the, uh, the look on them I've wanted. I'm really happy the way they're turning out. And, uh, well, I've just got a little bit more work to do on them, and they're going to be done. I'll probably be done by either tomorrow or Friday. I'm thinking tomorrow, though. I was going to put hair fringe on his shirt, but I think what I'm going to do is uh, maybe put regular fringe on his shirt because, quite honestly, the hair fringe uh, would be just too hard to do, uh, especially in the material it's going to be cast in. So... That's it for today. On a cold, snowy day in Montana. Just so you can see uh, what goes into creating a, a video that I create every, every day, and why it takes me three to four hours after I get back from the studio to do what I'm doing. This is just uh, today's video. Um, and the sound setup, uh, the music setup, and my voiceover setup, all in one shot there. The videos edited, each line indicates an edit, ed an edit. There's all the videos up there that I've uh, uploaded to this, uh, Sony Vegas Movie Studio HD Platinum program. And, uh, there's the video. All right, I'm going to be uploading uh, the video to uh, YouTube, and uh, you'll be watching it later on tonight. Just thought you'd like to see. All right, uh, if you liked the video, please subscribe and uh, give me a thumbs up. I'd appreciate it. Thanks.